Okay, what is that? A decoded orders, and then we've got uh, farmer's coin purse. I don't want to spend those just yet. Um, can I sell something now? Like maybe this garbage bow? Um, can I sell it? No. Um, it doesn't seem to work. Um, is there some way? Can I like destroy items, civilian bow? You know, I mean, I don't want my my stuff to get. Um, my bag to get full because I don't have a whole lot of space. But, um, let's see. Uh, let me ask can you sell the starter equipment? Or is it locked? I mean, they've, they've got some uh, some nice-looking gear here, but it's all, like, really expensive. So, you know, this one here says binds on pickup. Uh, it doesn't say it's untradeable or anything. You can sell it. I just sold some of mine. Um, okay. Uh, let's see. Can I right-click on this guy to reply? I think it was Control-Shift-R. Um... I can't seem to place it in the boxes to sell it. Uh, wasn't it Control Shift R or something to talk to that person? So did it go out? Select a target? Um, what do you mean select a target? Okay, so back to here. Um, I control R, control shift R, shift R. No, it obviously wasn't shift R. Um, hmm. So if I do this, whisper to, can I? Okay, so slash W. Um, so to F L E U R. Um, can't place it in the boxes to sell it. Okay, why is this not working? Okay, so two floors. So I can't place it in the boxes to sell it. There we go. I can't be too far away. What the heck? Let's try one more time. So I've got this... Um... The Grand Fearin Sword. Which I cannot put in there. I cannot place it. Um, why is somebody killing a rat? I don't know. All right, well, I'll just have to figure that out another time. Yes, absolutely. All right, let's go. I don't have time for this. Uh, yes, running, running, running. Well, somebody tried to help me, but it just didn't work for me, I guess. Um, okay, now we're going to pick this thing up. Oh, this guy has a quest. Oh, shot. Hello there. Interested in making a little coin? We fear and are rarely involved in big construction projects, so I've been asking passing travelers to help me build my home in exchange for a fair day's wage. So, how about it? Do you want to help me build my house? 
Here, take this lumber pack. It's pretty heavy, so you'll move a little slower carrying it to the house. But once you're there, the actual work won't take long at all. Okay, um... Yeah, it's... it's kind of heavy. Mm. Heavy, heavy. Oh, look, it's that Lucius thing. Okay, um... Ah, where'd it go? Ah. Uh. The house disappeared. <laughs> it says unfinished house. Okay, there we go. Now I can finish it. Woohoo! Build a house! Build a house! Um. Okay. Done with that. Back already! See, that wasn't so bad, was it? Building a whole house takes time, but if everyone helps out, it's a breeze. Remember, you need to be able to afford the taxes if you want to keep your house. But if you ever want to build your own, just visit Mirage Isle and purchase a design to get started. Thanks again. And somebody else has something for me to do. Oh, oh, hello. Are you here to build a home too? I know many fear and are still attached to the wandering lifestyle, but you don't have to be. Building a home has never been easier and it gives you a safe place to store items and display treasures. Why don't you go take a look inside my model home and see for yourself? Oh, Shad here took one look and started building his own house the next day. Okay, um... I'm supposed to go look at your house. Okay. Um... Well, look, it's a house. Um, yeah. Um, is that it? Huh. Oh. So those can open and close. Interesting. So that's it? Um. Okay, let's go. We're out of here, man. Okay, so report to refugee... UA. Whoa! What the heck was that? I didn't have no beans or nothing. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Looks like we've got another quest up here. Uh, looks like somebody named Jovesh. What can I do for you, Jovesh? Greetings, traveler. Will you help me perform the last rites for my snow lion? He was the best mount I ever raised, and he saved my life more than once. I would like to put him to rest in the traditional way. I don't think that's burgers. I know times are changing for our kind. Not everyone respects the old ways, but I believe our traditions are still important. Will you consume a piece of the snow lion's flesh and respect him as the mighty hunter he was in life? Huh, I guess it is burgers. <laughs> Eat a part of the snow lion. Awesome. Anybody get any ketchup? <clears throat> okay. Thank you, friend. It worries me sometimes to see young Fearon growing up in a world of airships and stone houses, but you've shown me the heart of our people is still strong. And now I must stand vigil as my friend begins his final journey. If you're headed to the Oxian clan, could you do me one more favor? This snow lion saddle should be delivered to my brother, Murnach. He raises snow lions, so I'm sure he'll put it to good use. Sure. Now that I've had uh, a tasty treat along the road, let's go and report to Murnach. Yeah, that sounds good. Hey, come on. Whoosh. I can't believe it really was a snow lion burger. <laughs> okay, so let's see. The refugee in Oxian. Okay, Mara Tam uh, Tamune. This is the warning, okay. Shima attack! 
We appreciate the effort, warrior, but I'm afraid you are too late. If there are multiple quest rewards to choose from, click one and select it, then click select reward to complete the quest. So we've got uh, upper chest piece or leather uh, leather upper chest piece. Well, I definitely um, half moon leather uppers chest or whisper wind cloth uppers chest. Well, you know, I'm much more of a fighter. Let's go with the leather. The Shima have already raised our northern settlement of midday's rest and are preparing another attack even as we speak. Escort Captain Sodaro is out there right now attempting to hold off the Shima and buy us time to prepare our defenses if you want to help meet him north of the ruins of midday's rest. Is that right next to, uh, you know, mid-afternoon feast? I don't know. Okay. So I'm level 8. Earned one skill point. So, um, let's see. Um, I don't have a 10 in archery yet, I suppose. Hmm. No, I don't. Basic? Melee kick. You know, I still haven't used my kick. Ooh, escape. Teleport you to the nearest respawn point. Um, report unauthorized program. Oh, uh, rider's escape. Teleport your vehicle to safety if it becomes trapped in the terrain. You become stuck in the terrain. Okay, okay. Basic abilities. Um, use glider, drop, dash, dance, countdown, cat-like reflexes, emotes. Okay, I'm not too worried about that. Proficiency. Um, how do I... Oh, okay, these are the skills and stuff that you have to use. So, um, increase. Increase total available specializations. I have no snowflakes. Um, language. Nuian, Elven, Firin, Harania, Continent, Dialect, Harani. Okay, so. Oh, wait. Um, skills. I forgot to do that. Uh, no. It's probably under here. Where do I get to my skills? Uh, you know what? I'm sure it's down here. Character info, bag, quest log, achievements, skills window. Here we are. Okay, so combat. Um... I suppose I don't have to spend it now. Um, so this one here triggers a leap toward an enemy that deals damage. Um, marked targets are tripped. Inflicts additional damage on marked targets. Increased duration of trip and stun on innervated targets. Um, I think I'm going to save that point because I want to get to um, Endless Arrows and make sure that I've got something for the next level when I get um, uh, Vitalism, which will give me the, uh, the healing abilities. Okay, so wielding two-handed weapon increases melee magic skill damage and heal amount by 5%. Well, you know, I'm using um, a two-handed weapon, so... Yes. Not dual wielding. Um, what is that thing doing? Um, okay, so... Escort Captain Stara. Let me go ahead and find the other two here that I need to turn in. Uh, over here, there's a refugee. This is Burnatch, Stable Hand. Ah, yes. Jovesh's saddle? How did you come by this? I see. If his snow lion has died, he must be standing vigil. He's always been especially close to his beasts, even for a Firin. Thank you, friend. I'll hold this for my brother until he feels ready to raise another mount. So, I eat some of his lion, and then I give back his saddle, and that's it? Okay. Alright, let's see. Um, I guess both of the other two are this way. Um, well, let's get going. Woohoo! Wow, that is a big looking thing over there, isn't it? Um, escort? Captain... There we are. Refugee UA. 
Bleak Breath Cave? I don't have time to worry about that hellhole. We've got problems of our own. I'd love to help you, but a recent Shima raid has left our refugee camp in ruins. The Oxian warriors are doing their best to drive off the Shima's henchmen, but our homes are still burning while they fight. If I promise to direct you to the cave, will you help us? We need to contain this fire before it's too late. Take these water pails and use them to put out the burning tents. There's no sense fighting for our village if the whole plane is burned to ashes. Really? Okay. So, um, douse tent fire. Oh no, there is a tent fire. Where do I get the water? Um, water, water everywhere? Is that it over there? No, that is a freed merchant? I don't understand. Revived falcon flower? What? Are, what? Are, what's up with you? Oh. Okay, never mind. So let me go over here. So, I mean, do I just, like, use this on here or what? Because, okay, burning tent. One. Gotcha. So basically I've got water. I honestly don't know how I carried three buckets of water with me. Two. Hey! Buddy. Wow. He almost killed me. Like, seriously. Here, let me take one of these. Woohoo! Okay, now I understand what's going on. So I just need to do one more. Wow, these guys are, like, pretty high level. They're level 8, though. He shouldn't be that strong, should he? Well, let's see how he does in a normal fight. Hey! Oh, another one just appeared. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna circle around this way, because I need to get that armor. Okay, let's go. Um, you know what? Did I get that armor? I suppose I ought to take a look in my bag, huh? Um... I did. Half Moon Leather Upper Chest. Okay, so I got unidentified half moon jerkin, unidentified guards, and unidentified fists. So that's weird. Um, I mean, obviously I can't put it on. I have to spend the labor points to open it. So let's do it. Okay, we've got um, leather armor, grand half moon jerkin. So okay, definitely gives me some uh, some nice armor there. So let's put that on. And let's see, let's put on the Half Moon Guards. Okay. Um, yeah, that looks good. And then this one is some Fists. Okay, which I guess this is Gloves. Um, there you go. Now, what does that mean? Start a conversation? Our homes may be lost, but at least we stopped the fire from spreading to the surrounding fields. Thank you, stranger, and don't worry. I'll still help you as promised. You're not the first warrior to go looking for Bleak Breath Cave, you know. But if Grell thinks you're ready, I suppose I can't argue. If you're set on going, take this letter to Ellen in Cloudgrain. She can tell you more about it. Okay. Um. Yay. Alright, so. I need to talk to this guy. Halt! Who goes there? Whisperwind tribe, huh? You're a long way from home, but you couldn't have come at a better time. We're holding on by a claw here, and these Narayana aren't worth scat in a fight. We'll take all the help you can give us. Okay. Um. Well, let's talk with, uh. 
the escort guard or wait wait um you know i think we're at about the time where i'm going to stop this episode uh what is this i've got a buff campfire the warm campfire increases stamina for 10 minutes oh that's kind of cool all right so um i'm gonna go ahead and stop here and we're gonna go and start uh episode four right after this so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next episode